Well, here I am in Dorothy. Is it Matt and Richard? Somebody suggested Dorothy, ghost town. Yonder is the ghost town. I went there. I noticed there was a campsite next to it, so I came here to camp and uh, waiting, obviously. You know. What's wrong with me? I don't know. It was too nice of a day. I was up at 5 this morning. Medicine hat. <laughs> and I went, okay, so here we are, Dorothy. Yeah. And I've seen everything else suspension bridges, mines. I haven't been on the mine train ride yet, two hours, 20 bucks, something like that. I might do that. <laughs> well, <laughs> but anyway, Dorothy. So here we are. Uh, and as in the campsite, there's just me. And there, there is, I don't know if you can see it, but back there is a uh, deposited trailer, I guess you'd call it. I don't know. Somebody just left it there. It's got an axe, which I was thinking maybe I was going to use because I got some wood for the fire later. Uh, I'm going to have a fire here. But I don't have an axe. But I don't think there's much chance of me making it to then. The way the sun's going, it's slow. Ah. Noises. So now, since, ever since I got here, I've been hearing these weird noises everywhere like one over there one over there one over there and it's like what hmm. now wake up in the morning and be a fucking crop circle i don't know <laughs> you know me <laughs> but uh all right here we are having fun actually the last few days on the road have been a hoot a real hoot yeah it was plagued with some financial horseshit with tires and stuff a little beast here, <laughs> just being a grump. But you know, I'm I'm a grump to her too. Don't necessarily. I, ma I maintain my cats probably better than I maintain this uh, machine, person, <laughs> thing. <laughs> I'm a big fan of it. It's done everything it was supposed to. It's paid for a long time ago. Well, not that long ago, but paid for. It's just the same. Yeah, no, three, four years. Uh, two. Something like that. Eight years old. I uh, won. It's been paid for for a year or two. <laughs> Doesn't matter. It's paid for. It's all it counts. It's mine. Get your eyes off it. Mine. Anyway, <clears throat> here I am on the top of Mount uh, Gazumu in uh, Alberta. 32,000 feet, I believe, here. There's a campsite conveniently on top here. Now, there's a few trucks rolling by, and they're. Uh, Apparently taking more building material to make it even higher. Uh, in the end, it'll be uh, 46,000 feet total. Uh, some tie into NASA somewhere, I think, you know, obviously. And uh, it's very nice, very nice. $15 a night, apparently, to stay here. I got my money on the pole over there under a peg waiting for somebody to come pick it up. Nobody's come yet. I don't know if they will. The place is deserted. Maybe this is part of Dorothy, which is a ghost town over there. You can't see much of it, but that's where it is. It's a ghost town. Well, it's a maintained ghost town, which kind of makes it weird. I like more, you know, there it is in the middle of nowhere, and boom. Nobody's been there in, well, since the last guy left. Or woman, you know. But, uh, but that is a ghost town. Mm -hmm. You know, of sorts. That's all I'll say. But I still appreciate being directed here because this whole thing, this whole scene is, is pretty cool. I'm liking it. Very nice. Now, when I get back from this crazy trip, this car will be for sale. Now, it's kind of expensive because it used to be a rally racer. And around 2007, I had a big old three painted here. Uh, and that's all been painted over with black. And yeah, it's proved itself once again today by going through some stuff that only four by four seemed to actually make it through. I made it, but it was dubious. <laughs> Bottomed out a lot of times. <laughs> you know, I'll take a couple of bucks off the sale price for that. Uh, 
but I'm asking uh, 84,000 for it because of, because of its history. I mean, it's gotten around the prairies. It's been a rally racer. Um, it was born under a, a shining star, magic star. I mean, it, the astrology that day was just off the map. It was saying gem. And I mean, look, here it is in top of Mount, whatever the hell this is, Kazumu. And I'm selling for $84,000. Take it or leave it. I mean, it's not important. But, uh, this is important, this whole scene here. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> last time we did this, it was uh, in the living room, I think, with the cats. Uh, this is uh, a little more over the top than that, I'm sure. <laughs> Unless you want me to get in my mind. You know what's so neat about being on the road is, sort of, I haven't checked yet here tonight, but you're away from the internet. You're away from the buzz. At least that's what I thought. When I got out, <laughs> every campsite's got the internet. Every motel's got the internet. It's all, you know, there you go. You're online. Boom. Theme. Um, I have my doubts about this place. If this place has internet, <laughs> Well, just mess with my belief system big time. I mean, they don't have to believe in camping here. Why would the hell would you have internet? Anyway, it might be it might be here, hidden somewhere. Oh, there's those little animals running around too. I don't know. I, I'll I'll post a picture of them, but they're not prairie dogs. They're too small. Prairie dogs, as I remember. Oh, maybe I'm thinking of gophers. Maybe these are prairie dogs. Okay, good. Well, I figured I'd probably answer my own question there. It's all good. Now the sponsors of the trip is uh, Black Ice. It's man's beer. You know, don't drink it unless you're, unless you got three hair, you know, somewhere here, you got some hair on your chest. If, if not, just stay away from it. It's like 6.1%. <sighs> Can get heavy at night. Um, <laughs> up there. Anyway, there's reported last night here was hail, big time. So I'm told by some lady who works back that way 10 miles. So I figured, well, hail. Hmm. So I figure camping, hmm, maybe it's motel night again. But you know what? It looks not bad here. So it's pretty good. Bugs, <laughs> bugs are crazy, but They fucking hate this stuff. They do. They just zoom. Every once in a while, you gotta put some in your ear and shit, you know, just keep them out. But this works, I find. I wouldn't want to be spraying it on me all the time, but for a little weekend or a little two week excursion like this, why not? Anyway, so this is this is it. This is a drum. Oh, I gave it away. It's supposed to be a mountaintop. It's drum hell earth. The Dorothy probably gave it away before. And it's a hoot. It really is. It's, it's just so peaceful being out here in this majesty of the uh, of this area. What occurs to me here, though, is the, weird, <laughs> the weirdness of all this. I don't know if you can see it. Not really. But, you know, there's this, there's this valley in between these two hill structures and what you see is carved information suggesting something I think it used to be a river to be honest with you a big one years ago years and years ago giant river I put money on it <laughs> I mean, oh, this might you know, it's a fucking river used to be you know. I google it but not from here Oops, wrong way. Now, as you can see, the sun's become more active due to lack of clouds. And I got, I believe you can see with this 10 millimeter, uh, the rain awning thing on the tent. Uh, it took me three times to put it on. I kept putting it on, sitting back. That, that ain't right. <laughs> I'll sit back. Okay. It was this extra pole. I didn't know what to do with it. But that went in the, in the top of that sucker. That's for sale. Yeah. 
Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> uh, 90 bucks. 90 dollars, yep. Complete with what you see. And another 84,000, you get this. Getaway, camp away vehicle. Anyway, it's the end of my report. I'm probably starting to get a little redundant, and that's all we know. All right. <laughs> uh.